All right, thanks for rejoining us here on this 2003 Sea Ray Sundancer 280 Express Cruiser for sale here on the beautiful fresh waters of North Lake, Tennessee. This one does come with a transferable boat slip and a trailer. A slip is optional, um, but the trailer is included. Um, and, and I also should point out, I think I mentioned it in, uh, in part one of the video, um, the, the boat may not stay in this exact slip, but there is a slip here at the marina um, that can transfer with this one again if you're wanting to keep it right here on Norris Lake. So we just left the cabin area and we're about ready to raise the engine engine compartment. Give it a little lift here. And notice that that bench actually kind of swivels. That's designed to do that. And then here's these twin 4.3 liter Merc Cruiser. Multi-port fuel injected inboard outboard stern drive engines again alpha one out drives we looked at those before we climbed in the boat uh, First thing I'll point out to you right here in between the engines. That is a sea fire automatic fire extinguisher system That will sometimes get you a small insurance discount um, and then Here's these 4.3 multi-port fuel injected Mercruiser engines. We've got a thousand and I think it's 52 hours on the port side and 900, I want to say about around 50. Again, I'm going to have the exact engine hours at the website. Um, that's one reason we always refer you there. Um, those engine oil, oil uh, filters, or oil and filters were changed at the 980 mark. And then just on the uh, farther port side of this port side engine, we've got your six gallon dual source hot water heater. The dual source basically means you do not have to have shore power or the generator to make hot water. Simply running this port engine will warm up uh, your the water that's in the hot water heater. So that's why that's that's a really nice option. Onboard battery charger there. We've got three batteries, uh, basically starting battery for each generator, um, each engine, and then um, one of those two engine batteries will be the house battery system. We've got a uh, cockpit table is stored right here in your engine room. It's nice to have that in its own convenient little storage so you always know where to find it and where it is. Oh, and I should say just behind those batteries is your onboard fresh water tank. I'll have the exact uh, capacity of that tank again at the website with the full specs. If you make it over the slideshow page, look for the printable uh, PDF spec sheet and that's going to show you exactly how many gallons of fuel, water, and uh, wastewater that you can carry. What you're looking at now is your wastewater tank and your vacuum flush equipment. And then right over here, this is your 5KW West, um, <laughs> almost said Westerbeek. That's a 5KW Kohler onboard marine generator. And there are about 733 hours on that one. Yeah, 733.3. So we'll probably round that up to 734 for the listing on it. All right, so we're going to lower this hatch back down. And that's back locked into place. Let me tell you those engine hours right quick here before we before we conclude this one. 1,052 on the port side. 981.8 on the starboard side. I was way off on the starboard side. So we'll round that up to 982. And that is 1,052 even on the port. And again, 733.3 on that 5KW Kohler generator. All right, so that's going to start to wrap things up for us here today. With again, with the 2003 Sea Ray 280 Sundancer for sale here on the beautiful freshwaters of Norris Lake. Um, I'm going to step up up to the gunnel here and show you the top of this uh, radar arch is a radar. That's what, uh, that's what the radar arches are for. Uh, most of the time, uh, your boats do not have radar. Um, you'll have your other antennas. That's a VHF antenna that you see about the center of the frame now. Um, that's your Raymarine digital radar. Got an anchor light with LED lights, nice and bright. Um, just to the port side of that is gonna be your um, that's a CV, basically that's a TV antenna. Um, that's an analog antenna, so you need a, a digital uh, to go along with that, but that can boost your digital antenna sometimes. And then just uh, to the left of it, there's a small little puck. That's the satellite 
uh, receiver for your satellite uh, capable stereo unit. So I'll climb back off of this one, kind of do one more walk around of the exterior and, and uh, again, I'll invite you to the website for more details on this one. If you, uh, if you have any questions, please contact us through there. We do not monitor the YouTube comment section. If you ever, uh, well, once you make it to our website, you can reach us by phone, by text, or by email. All of that contact info is gonna be there. Um, if you call us on the phone and would like a return phone call, say you get our voicemail, just make sure to leave me a detailed message. Let me know which listing you're looking at, what questions you have. I'm often in areas without cell phone reception. Um, and it's often, if you don't leave a message, I'll have no idea that you called. So again, this is the 2003 C-Ray 280 Sundancer for sale with a trailer here on Norris Lake. This one really is loaded up. It's, um, it's got a lot of the options, if not all of them. And uh, this has been our, our first night video. We'll see how it turns out. It may be our last, but this one sure was fun. And thank you again for joining us. Again, I uh, refer you to the website for any questions. That's where you're going to get all of our contact info. And you'll see the yournewboat.com logo popping up in the top right-hand corner of the screen. And that is to be subscribed to our YouTube channel. So whether you're in the market or uh, just really enjoy keeping an eye on inventory that's hitting the Norris Lake market, or just passing some time while you're supposed to be working. Either way, we'd love to have you subscribe to our channel and that way you'll be notified of any new listings that comes available in our area. I thank you again for joining us.